Coronavirus cases are increasing all over the country. In fact, as of today, 19 states are reporting an increase in their coronavirus cases. And not only that, but there have been an increase in hospitalizations in some areas, which by the way, is a big deal because it, it, it means not only are people just being diagnosed more with coronavirus, right? I mean, we're gonna have that with more testing, but the fact that they're being hospitalized more means that they're also sicker. That's a little bit of a different metric and very important. This worries me big time. And in my opinion, it should worry you too. You know, honestly, I feel like we've been acting as though it's been sort of business as usual, functioning as though coronavirus is over. Um, I walk, I take my daily walks here in Philadelphia every day and I see people without wearing masks. I feel like every day I'm dodging people, zigzagging, walking around them, crossing the street, trying to avoid them because there are runners, walkers, people without masks. And I see more and more and more every single day. People not social distancing, people gathering together and getting together as though we're done with the virus. Like it's over. Uh, we did that. We're done with that. We're not done with that. It's not over. And in fact, I think the first wave of coronavirus is still happening. And states that weren't being hit before are now being hit. States like Texas, Florida, Arizona, California, South Carolina. And a lot of these increases we've seen after Memorial Day. We have to stop thinking that it's over. Because you know what, guys? It's not over. It's just not. We have to wear masks. I've been saying this and so many of us have been saying this and I know so many of you wear masks, but I also know you know how many people don't because we see people every day not wearing masks. Remember, guys, when we don't wear masks, it's not only disrespectful to other people, it's disrespectful for ourselves. All the work that we've done the last few months, hunkering down, people losing jobs, the economy tanking, and now you wanna not wear a mask? You wanna pretend like it's over? Take the risk that we're gonna go back to where we were before? That's not smart. So I'm saying, please wear your masks. And if someone's not wearing one around you, please ask them to. Please social distance, please wash your hands, please use hand sanitizer, please continue doing all these things because one of my biggest fears is that not only is it going to be 19 states as we see today with increased numbers, that number is going to continue to climb. It's unfair and we are losing Americans. We are losing Americans to a virus that, yo, you're right, we can't not control this virus, but we are losing Americans to a virus that perhaps we can mitigate and mitigate even better by wearing our mask and washing our hands and things like this. Think about all the people who are losing their lives. Think about that. We have to do better, and I know we can do better. So let's make sure that we do that. Please share this video with anyone that you think it might be helpful for. Please also make sure that you're wearing your mask and doing all of those things we always talk about. If you're interested in sending stars, I answer your questions first. And please make sure you like and follow my page. I'm doing health videos every single day, guys. I am Dr. Jen Caudill. I'll see you soon.